Hi there, Retro25 with another Transformers toy review. I'm sorry I haven't come with a Transformers Prime review because they haven't shown anything else other than Jewel of the Machines. But, like I said, sit on a previous video. As soon as that comes out, I will be doing a review as soon as possible. Yeah, today's review is on this guy. Transformers Beast Wars Second Galvatron. He does look like a bit like Transformers G1 Galvatron's colour scheme, but he's a lot better. He's a tank drill monster. This thing is actually quite big. It's quite long and quite lengthy. Um, issue on Galvatron in Beast Wars Second. Galvatron's the Emperor of Destruction. He is. He is a messenger from. Well, he's actually part of the Predacons, you know, leader of the Predacons. <laughs> well, he decides to go to um, a planet called Gaia, which is Earth, in the future. Finds a master control p computer, downloads the all his warriors to be the most powerful sphere weapon uh, vehicle al artillery that's been in the planet's history um so he's um when it comes to him he accidentally downloads a beast form as well as this i have no idea this what this is meant to be but it looks cool. It's like a drill. With two machine guns on. Roll two machine guns on the front. <coughs> yeah, he's down there and he has a brother called Gigastorm. And he's a very, very likeness of G2 Megatron. I'm leaving that as that. Yeah. So he's but he's actually a herald of something called the Dark Destructor. This Dark Destructor is actually Unicron. He's in a ha in the first about ten episodes for that. Five to ten episodes is in a stasis lock because he is overwhelmed with this power. And he's, he's overwhelmed with the power of. and he becomes even more power hungry, but he has absorbed another power as well, as long as that, and that's to make himself into a giant giant he does end up dying in the very <laughs> sorry about that. he does end up dying in the very last episode of Beast Wars Second there's only two mods that ever came out in Beast Wars Second what was a brand new mods this one and Lyle Convoy what I have done before um he he ends up going insane with this power trying to bring out this em emperor of destruction and um, his warriors start to turn on him and start listening to Gigastorm instead of Galvatron um but that's basically it on um, Galvatron. All he does is go around ranting and raving and 
destroying things without a second thought. But he does return in Beast Wars Neil. Not as. He starts off as an empty shell. So there's one little bit of dark energy still left in this dark nebula, what he calls down from the galaxy to destroy worlds, which is Galvatron. Um, he there was enough energy to take forms from bit of moulding from his form and the unicron energy to make three more wires and these are fusors and these are really evil and sick as anything I can tell you so he comes back again as Galvatron the great I mean you the crow but he doesn't have the ability to turn into the tank he stays in his second form which is a dragon and he doesn't turn into his robot mold they're trying to these fusards try to get as much energy on to Stop the Maximals from the Beast Wars second on to dis to bring back Unicron. Probably not as full power as they killed, but they make his body into this into Galvatron. So Galvatron is dead. Just non existent, never to be seen again, but he does come back as Unicron. That's about it on the back. Well, okay, time for the toy. The toy, as you see, is a drill tank kind of thing. It's a very light G1 kind of thing, and he does have a gimmick. There's a button there on the back, quite black. If you press it and it goes, turns into a drill kind of format. Does have his machine gun to it. He does have very nice molding of tank treads underneath, but they don't roll. They are actually on with wheel, little wheels underneath. He does have this thing at the back his tail which has a unique feature itself it, it's two well, two missile launchers they do fire very, very powerful springs that's why I had all of it I don't want to fire them out underneath not very much robot because we do see his chest and that's it on here got these things I think these are meant to be armor guards but turns into his wings these but they do have another mold I'll show you that in robot like I say he's a triple changer his first mold is this to turn him into his second mold which is the dragon what you do is take his legs spread them apart like that so he's kind of doing some kind of Battlestar Galactica kind of thing. Take his tank treads, turn them to the side up on the cells. <coughs> uh, yeah, you open his tank treads there, like that, and fold them all the way around. Then you take his dragon legs from his gold his feet. 
like that and you push them out like that then you get his legs and turn them down like that you unclip his bottom like that and unfold his wings like that push his wings the guards down so they can form into some kind of wing kind of thing then you fold them back on each other to like a little clip kind of thing and you fold the groin crotch kind of thing and you clip it in and that's basically him halfway done like that you get his dragon claws which you can plainly see on the tank mode you push them down and this gold bit is gold plastic so it does have the gold plastic disease you open it but it's not as bad as normal gold plastic you turn unlock them spread them out and they do turn around to form some kind of shoulder pad and that's about it you fold up this and there you have it. Galvatron, and you push up his tail. So there he is, Galvatron in dragon mode. I think he's quite a nice dragon. This is the form that he takes in Beast Wars um, Neo as Galvatron. I mean, Unicron. It does have an opening mouth if you can get it like that, and this bit also you push back to make his arm tacky, Chris. Um, is well, the only thing is, it does have the machine guns on him, so if he's shooting, he will have to do that face like that. I don't really care, but he does. He is still quite. He's very big, and I say he's a very nice transformer. You can also have his wings like that, or you can rotate his wings out, and he can fly. If you can see. This is going to have to be a two part of this one. So this is Ratchet signing off for part one. This is going to, I'll be back for part two.